Where do we start on this one? Five, four or five weeks ago, we left Catherine, and I'm pretty sure that was the last video that we've done, uh, and the plan was to head to Darwin. Well, we arrived in Darwin on a Friday, and we started work with the company on Monday after catching up with a mate, and he pretty much convinced us <laughs> is the best way to describe it. So anyway, we're back working. All right. And so this video is gonna be all over the place. We really don't know how to edit this one or what we're gonna be doing. So anyway, just bear with it, we'll explain later. So the first part of this video is we are in, in Darwin, we've arrived in Darwin and it's, I said Friday, but it must've been Thursday because we went to Mindle Beach. Mm. Is that Mindle Markets? Yep. Mindle Markets, so all right, let's kick this video off starting at Mindle Markets. Work it. So we're about to walk into the Mindle Markets now. There's a million people, so I uh, don't want to be getting this camera out too often, so we'll try and discreetly if we can. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice. <laughs> you haven't even had a bite of it yet, and it sounds nice. Nice. Once you start, you can't stop. Oh, you got milk it like a cow. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's wrong stuff. It's hard to get out. <laughs> That's how it's done, folks. So we went to the markets last night. That was busy. Um, yeah, because yeah, we were there in the area. The markets went on, but we we're in the same area the night before. Yeah, and there was no there one was there. Nobody there. And then when the markets are on, there's about a million people on the beach. Everyone. And then they will start clapping, including this one when the sun goes down. It was because the man was playing his guitar song, whatever song it was, and it ended at the same time. It was perfect timing. <laughs> <laughs> so today we've come out to the tunnels. Um, it was told to us, what well, was recommended World to War us, II. coming World out to the World War II tunnels. So we're here, we're going to try getting out of the sun because it's about 45 degrees it feels like. And we nearly... And we're and we're petals. And we nearly got scammed on the car park. Yeah, so the car park behind us was going to charge us 60 bucks $60 US. US. Yeah, um, so. yeah, something's not right there. So anyway. So hopefully that didn't go through. Mm. And the $5 Aussie one. That's going to be like about Literally. maybe 100 bucks Australian. 120 so. maybe. Yeah. yeah, so anyway, let's go Spend check these tunnels out. Old mate behind me here means only one thing. We're in Humpty Doo. Here we go. Oh, you got that on. I'm not going to do what I was going to do. <laughs> I 
was going to have to do. <laughs> <laughs> So we're just doing a quick stop off at Berry Springs. We're going to go check it out before we go, decide to get changed and go in. Now, I already know what the answer is going to be. We're going to go in, but i just got to wait for the boss. You've got me questioning my position Am I just feeling out? So, last time we were here, this was packed. It was at a night, it was in the evening though. Mm. Yeah, it was. Um, that was back, I reckon it was been June or July or something, 2018, I think it might have been. Yeah. So, yeah, a few years ago. Um, it was very quiet and peaceful. Yeah, different, hey? And nice, different. like the weather's not too bad. Piccolo goes into storage for three months at this stage. Tonight we are packing our bags and we're in a motel room as of tomorrow night. Across the road. <laughs> yeah, literally St. Park, believe it or not. Now this happened really quick, like super quick. Within oh, four hours, three hours. <laughs> yeah, so that's how quick things are moving. Um, but yeah, pretty excited, so hopefully a new chapter and uh, we'll see how it all goes. We had to go buy suitcases, believe it or not, two little suitcases. Um, I think they might even be too big, but... Excuse me, they're too little. So anyway, we're going to pack up everything, so we've just packed it up and I'm going to show you where we're staying for the next nine days. And then Piccolo goes in storage for three months. Yeah, and condiments is an issue. Yeah. <laughs> from the condiment kings. <laughs> I don't know where we're gonna put them. All right, I'll show you where we're staying. As you can see, we've already got most of our stuff here. It's a bit of a short walk. Um, yeah, this is home for the next nine days. Now we got all this stuff here. Look at this. It has to fit into that somehow. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's going to fit. So I think we've got a lot of consuming to do. Well, that I'm includes gonna... alcohol, so I can free up some of the room in the back of the car. There's no freezer either. So, oh. is it? Oh, not suitable for freezing food. Ah, there you go. No freezer. Just looked at our stats, Peg. Make sure you subscribe because if I can get 500, that's 500 subscribers, Peg said I can get a new GoPro. And just to be clear, we don't make money on any of that. I'm just saying if we can get to 500, we'll stretch the budget. <laughs> Come on, subscribe now. <laughs> We've hit 500 subscribers. Oh, and what does that mean? <laughs> Get to GoPro. go buy another GoPro. <laughs> Woohoo! So thank you very much. So yes, off to get a GoPro, but <laughs> I'm going to postpone that at the moment. We'll get a GoPro a bit later. Yeah, we've got a few things happening, so GoPro will just have to be put on the back burner, so. Yeah, that's yeah. okay. Anyway, what beach is this? Lamaru. This is Lamaru in Darwin. Not a bad evening. No, Why yeah. everyone's freezing in Adelaide? Yeah, I'm actually <laughs> starting to get really hot.
production. <laughs> so the company we work for, they send us to remote parts of Northern Australia. So we're in a little community called Nuka at the moment. Uh, we could be here for two weeks, three weeks. Uh, we really don't know. And at a drop of a hat, they could just send us an email and say, right, we need you in another part of Australia, which is pretty good. So we're pretty excited about that. Behind me here is the Roper River. So while the weather is good, I think we should get Ramon up and have a bit of a look around. I haven't flown Ramon for a while. It's hit a tree, taken a tumble, and it's out there. Bait. We are bait. Yeah. Anyway, we got Ramon back. Woohoo! Does it work? <laughs> More important thing, we got Ramon back. Happy days. Anyway, this is the Roper River. From the air, crash, and obviously me going to rescue Ramon. So. It's supposed to be a relaxing day off. Um, feeling stressed. That I'll 